GPT-5 is getting better and better. Like I'm starting to love it actually, but there's one little thing that's still causing a little bit of a problem, which is if you're using GPT stacking. And if you don't know what GPT stacking is, I'm going to show you right now. It's my favorite thing to do inside ChatGPT, where you can get multiple GPTs to stack all together. But if there's one little caveat, I'm going to show you on my computer. Okay, so I'm here on my computer, and if I type the at symbol, what used to always happen is, huh, it's still happening, these GPTs will show up that I've used before, right? But the problem is now with GPT-5, if you try to do it while you're inside another GPT, this will not pop up. So let me just show you. So I'm inside this GPT. Watch if I type the at symbol. Even if I wait a little bit, it's not going to pop up. Those little GPTs, like I can type in the letters, it's not going to work inside of another GPT. And there's one more thing to pay attention to because there's one more little trick. Okay, so like I said, you want to be inside a blank GPT, or sorry, just like a blank chat. That's where you're going to be able to pull this up. But here's the other thing. I've noticed sometimes when I hit the A, it doesn't bring something up. And so if I type the letter, it has to be the first letter of the GPT. I then sometimes will hit the right arrow or the left arrow, and then it'll trigger it. It's like it's just taking a little bit longer to pull them up. But if I try to type like the second word, it doesn't work. You have to type the first letter of the GPT to get it to show up. I hope that helps. Bye.